Saturday, 11.30 p.m. Carly Russell returned to her residence. Hoover police and fire responded to the scene to evacuate her to the hospital for further evaluation. What you are about to see is a video showing her vehicle and shadows surrounding her vehicle during the night of her disappearance. Here is footage of her car from the night she disappeared. Notice that you see a figure go out to the driver's side and then appear to the passenger side. You then see what appears to be two people outside of the passenger side. They then move away from the car towards the woods. In a minute, you're going to see Carly get out of the car. There she goes out of the car on the left side, walk around and she appears on the right side. You see that black thin figure on the right side. We did it again there. In just a few minutes, you will start to see that that area looks like someone else is possibly with her. And in a minute, if you look at the right side, you will actually see that it looks as if there are two figures standing there. I'm going to freeze it when we get to that point. Right there. So that's a wider, it's, it's a wider black area spot. The two figures standing there next to each other. I'm going to scrub it back and forth so that you can see that they go towards the woods to the right, back again towards the right. That's me moving it back and forth. <laughs> and you're going to see it in a minute that they disappear into the darkness there towards the woods. I will now scrub the video back and forth so that you can see the two people moving back and forth from the car and then show them walking into the woods. In this frame, I've isolated what looks like two people on the passenger side of the car. And those two figures then move away from the car and into the woods. So what do you think? Leave your opinion in the comments. Thanks so much for watching Deb's True Crime Notebook. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave a comment.